Hi, this is the Tamat Did What podcast, and I'm Tamat Did What. I just wanted to say thank you for your patience. I am trying to get used to podcasting on a monthly schedule. I hope to make this a little longer than the last one, but this is my second podcast, and I'm still learning the ropes. I just got the hang of Shotcut, uh, and they updated it. They upgraded, like, updated the software. Wow. Yeah. So, this podcast is still... Cooking, I guess you could say. Not sure what it is. Just feeling my way through. Don't know what it's supposed to be. I... You can look at the first one to see my introduction, but I have some things that I've made or am making or am in the process of making. Uh, This is the Coffee Table Topper by Agnes Russell. This is what I have so far. So, yeah, I do doilies. Well, not in that way, but anyway. I make doilies, I should say. That's for friends of mine who will hopefully get their doilies pretty soon. And I am also making Behold the Power of Chin. A window pane scarf from my mother. This is by Adrian Lash, I believe her name is. Not of I don't think the pattern's available on Ravelry anymore, but I found it on um Oh, what is that site? When I found when I found it, it was on Ravelry, and it's not on Ravelry anymore. But I've always liked the pattern, so and I have like a really really old copy. So that's me. And then, oh, the coffee table topper, by the way, is by Agnes Russell. I don't know if I said that. And also. This is the last of the large squares in the blanket I'm making. Granny's a square. It's to nine square, nine large squares in total. And they're like smaller squares and then they're even smaller squares than that. And then you stitch them all together. Well, obviously you do, otherwise it wouldn't be a blanket. And my colors are rotating in a varied pet like manner because I'm using Lion Brand's Mandala yarn in the colorways Gnome and uh, Wizard as the variegated color, and I'm using Lion Brand's Pound of Love in the colorways Cherry Red and Hunter Green. Um, to, you know, be the solid colors. I don't know if I'm going to use another color to unify it all, or if I'm just going to go ahead and use a second, you know, color, like cherry red or something to, you know, stitch it all together. I mean, I just, this is going to be Franken blanket, basically. So, but this is how much I have left of the gnome. So that's pretty cool. I am also working on socks. I have been working on them for some time. If I can grab them. Oh no. Okay, I got them. 
I'm in the middle of doing a heel flap. And yeah. I don't know if you can see that, but it's a bit of a dog's breakfast, but I'm keeping count. I'm using the B counter to keep count of my rows. So I'm in the 16th row of the heel flap right now. Oh, this is a uh, Lion Brands Sockies in the colorway Snow Cone. And these socks are from my friend Todd. And I can't think of anything else that I'm doing at the moment that is pressing. I am working on an, an antler card again, but it's on ice until I get some of these other things situated. I'll start working on that again once I get the socks done. Uh, what else? I know what I can do. I can show you some stuff that I previously finished. I made this a long time ago, but yeah, some finished object would do. To prove that I actually can knit and crochet. <laughs> this is... I hope I don't fall back. <laughs> Yay! Wait a minute. It's a lot. This is the... I believe it's called, oh. You know how something's in your head and you just forget it completely? I believe this is called a Top Down Shawl by um, Nazanin Fard, but I'm gonna look it up to be sure. Which is entertaining for everyone, I'm sure. And because this is the seventh time I've done this, I believe this is it. Yeah. It's the Top Down Shawl by Nazanin Esfard. And I did it in two different yarns, obviously. The larger of the two yarns is, I mean, the more expansive of the two yarns is Knit Picks, Swish, and the colorway Wine Tasting. And the lesser of the two yarns is Lion Brand. Oh, what is this? This is why we keep notes. Okay, I got you. I need my glasses, but I got you. Knit Pick Swish Tonal in a colorway wine tasting and Lime Brand Superwash Merino Cashmere in a colorway green tea. That was riveting. But I made this back in
2015? Yeah, 2015. April of 2015. It's my birthday shawl. Because I'm in Aries. Not that I actually subscribe to that, but... And this old thing, well not old because it's actually younger than the shawl, I'm just, I wear it more. This is my flax sweater that gets a lot of wear. I don't know if you can see it in this light, but it's, hold on. Nope, can't see it. Anyway. I knitted this one up between 2017 and 2018. It took me 10 months to knit, 10 months and two weeks to knit. And it's warm and it's mine. And yeah, it's a pretty good sweater, you know? Oh yeah, the hat. Um, this is the His and Hers hat by Shel Grisham, and like I said, I have other things sitting around this room that, you know, are either done or, oh, I have one for you. This is old, but... I can't believe I actually committed to this one, but it's mine and I like it, so tough. It matches the hat. Prepare yourselves. Yes, I went there. For a while I was obsessed with uh, Red Hearts Super Saver Mexicana yarn. And I literally would have knitted underwear in that yarn if I had the chance. But I did knit and crochet a shawl. And the hat. There's a matching scarf. I made socks at one point. Um... I have, I made two pairs of mittens, knit and crochet. They're not warm. I learned about the properties of wool after that. Yeah. And yeah, just, no. So, they're like fashionable, but you know, form follows function. So they're not very functional. But these are like early projects that I did way, way back in the day. And what else? Oh, can't forget this one. This is my baby. I did say I like window pane scarves. This is the first one I made. This is my window pane scarf. And Knit Picks Chroma in the colorway Seaweed. Don't know if it's visible, but it's like a greenish seaweedy color. 
Yeah. What else? I think that's about it. That's probably longer than seven minutes, so. Haven't been up to much, just knitting, crocheting, watching YouTube videos, living my life, and yeah, that's about it really. Living vampire hours for the most part, because that's the only time I can get to knit because I'm usually so busy during the day. I try to get sleep, but mm -mm. something of an insomniac and always have been since I was a baby. I'm hoping that I will get these socks because that's what I'm going to focus on now that I've gotten this last big square done. I'm hoping to get the socks done by the weekend's end. Don't hold me to that because yeah, life happens, but yeah, fingers crossed I will get that done. Anything else? Oh. My earphones broke and these are new. So if you're hearing me, that's why. They're Bluetooth, so. And I think that's about it. Yeah, that's gotta be above seven minutes. Thanks for watching. Bye.